are walking all over cancer on our way to Springfield. Make sure you support the cause, support the movement. A South Suburban politician spends taxpayer dollars on a march to Springfield to promote her personal charity. But when we started asking questions, the party's over. Fox 32 and the Illinois Answers Project, part of the Better Government Association, are investigating the charitable foundation of Tiffany Hen Henyard, who is on two public payrolls as Dalton Mayor and Thornship Township Supervisor. What we found is raising serious questions about the use of taxpayers' dollars, employees, and equipment. Fox 32's Dane Placco investigates where all that money is going. Nobody knows something. Don't know nobody knows nothing. Tiffany Henyard certainly isn't shy about attracting attention. Here she is starting a Dalton Village board meeting dressed like the Wesley Snipes character in the movie New Jack City. Later punctuating her political points with the help of her own DJ. Every single resident, pay me what you owe me. Thank you, DJ. Henyard's picture and name adorn virtually every public posting, both from Dalton, where as mayor she makes $46,000 a year, and in Thornton Township, where as the elected supervisor, she collects more than $200,000 a year. But for all that money, Henyard's tenure at both has been chaotic, with firings, scandals, and a legal battle with the Dalton trustees over spending. Hey, hey. So last fall, Henyard did something that would seemingly generate some good publicity, helping establish the Tiffany Henyard Cares Foundation to help breast cancer patients. And on the very day the charity was chartered, it received a huge donation, $10,000, from the Thornton Township Board, which Henyard presides over. Taxpayer money shouldn't be paid into those types of things. Stephanie Wiedemann is the former Thornton Township Chief of Staff whom Henyard fired shortly after taking over in March of last year. It almost felt like a takeover and a, a very aggressive one at that. Since her firing, Wiedemann has been documenting township spending and says she's stunned by the taxpayer dollars funneled into Henyard's charity, especially this. We got 10 days, we're going 196 miles. Last October, Henyard led a delegation of Dalton and Thornton Township employees and political supporters on a march to Springfield to promote her breast cancer charity, which she documented on her Facebook page. We're walking through Dalton. Now, hi, we're in Brightwood now. We are in Godly now. We in Bloomington, baby. I can pretty much map out their entire Springfield trip on the township credit cards. That's right, Henyard billed thousands of dollars in hotel rooms and meals during the trip to Thornton Township and Dalton credit cards. In addition, the video show Henyard used multiple village and township vehicles owned by taxpayers to escort the caravan, including a flatbed trailer with a photographer, flying a drone, and a DJ. We got our band right here coming from Dalton, Illinois, walking all the way to Springfield. Yeah. But they didn't always walk. We on motorbikes, baby. At times, riding electric bikes. Yeah, I see my bike. I our town supervisor. It looks like a misspending of tax funds. Um, I think that's the biggest that, that's the biggest concern. Dalton trustee Jason House has been doing battle with the mayor since she took office. Very disturbing to hear these things or to kind of see some of the receipts that appear to be connected to it. And I think the taxpayers really deserve better than that. And then there's the merch. There's a shirt. One of t-shirts. Along the way, Henyard sold and gave away t-shirts and hoodies, also available on her charity's website. A week before the trip, the township paid $17,000 for specially printed hoodies and t-shirts, but won't say what they're for. I think that everything she has initiated has been something to promote her something to get her name in household, something to get people to buy into voting for her. Our investigation found at least $11,000 in public funds spent on that trip. But both Dalton and Thornton Township have been slow or unresponsive to open records requests. So what was the purpose of the 10-day march to Springfield? I have created a bill uh, which we're going to speak before the Revenue Committee to give everybody $5,000 on an income tax when they file if you are suffering from cancer. A noble goal, except the Revenue Committee wasn't meeting when the group arrived in Springfield. Henyard did later testify at a committee hearing in Chicago, but so far nothing has come of her bill. I think I'm doing a damn good job on leaving. 
So we went to a recent Thornton Township board meeting to ask Henyard some questions about all that spending. I've never ever been um, bitter to the news. He asked, this is my olive branch to the media. Can you guys reach out to us and ask us our opinion before you post it? I would appreciate it. And so we did. I want to ask you a few questions. Okay. But Henyard wasn't anxious to talk about her charity. Why did you and the, and the board vote to give your foundation $10,000? I'm the face of the foundation. My name is Nowhere, sir. Say so, yes. I'm the face. The face. You're the face. What was the purpose of going to Springfield? Hey, you guys. Hey, she doesn't have any more comments, guys. No, we're going to talk. She we're doesn't have talk. any more comments. Thanks, no. guys. That's Keith Freeman, whom Henyard hired at both Dalton and Thornton Township and was part of her Springfield walk. Look at Keith. Keep baby! Freeman also filed paperwork for the charity bearing Henyard's name. Why are you using public money for your personal charity? $17,000. And with that, her security detail hustled Henyard upstairs and blocked the staircase with a table. So we tried asking another employee who went on that trip. You went down to Springfield, and what were you hoping to do you in Springfield? You need to ask the people that handles that. I'm not the one to handle that. I was just riding the bike. We need more officers on the streets. We need our streets repaved. Um, so to spend that kind of money on a charitable event or supposed charitable event really doesn't seem like the best use of tax dollars. We also sent Henyard a detailed list of questions about her charity and how the money is being used. We've not yet heard back. Dane Placco, Fox 32 Chicago.